The urban forest is the forest where we live. The trees that line our streets, the trees in our parks, the trees in our yards, the natural areas that are set aside. So if you just look around the next time you're in a community and look at the trees, that's the urban forest. Welcome to my workspace. This is Urban Forestry Central, if you will, here at the Department of Natural Resources. I'm Sarah Griffith. I'm the Urban and Community Forestry Program Manager with the Washington State Department of Natural Resources. I wish there was an average day in what I do. Sometimes I'm teaching classes to citizen groups or presenting information before city councils, talking about urban tree management. As you can see, these trees are fantastic. They're old and they're beautiful, but they aren't very healthy. What we want to see is for engineers and for planners to work more closely with their urban foresters to make sure that there's adequate space for these beautiful large trees in our community. I love the idea that my job is making a difference in the communities in the state of Washington. We're planting trees, we're taking care of those trees so that future generations have clean air and clean water, that they have cities that are beautiful places to live. This forest is beautiful and we're only a few blocks from downtown Olympia. During my time at WSU, I took a lot of different classes in environmental policy, in conservation biology, in looking at different ways the ecosystem works. We weren't given just forestry or just land management. We were given a lot of different skills that maybe at the time I thought, what am I going to use this for when I grow up? And it turns out that that was the best part of my degree. We did a lot of work with elk, and we worked with some moose, and we had a fantastic time working with the bears looking at how animals interact with people and how their systems function in the forest and at zoos and other places. It turned out that having a really broad-based degree gave me a lot of opportunities in the natural resources field. Maybe someone who was just driving by would never notice, but to an urban forester, these are something that must be managed and have to be inspected to make sure that the public is safe. With a degree in natural resources, your opportunities are endless. You can work in the woods, you can work as a park ranger, you can work in an urban environment like I do, you can do soil conservation, water conservation, work in fisheries. There's a lot of different avenues that people with natural resources degrees can take. And I was lucky enough that my degree was broad enough that I was able to get a job that I didn't even know existed when I was a college student. Of course, my WSU sign, making sure that everyone knows I'm a true Coug. Well, who doesn't enjoy their time as a Coug? I had a great time. My education at WSU definitely led me uh, to this job and gave me a really broad foundation that I was able to utilize and to turn into something that I really, really love doing. Go Cougs!